are closer than they appear. Oh, you did this is like these. Are, I feel like it's because maybe you have a baby, uh, four, 20 babies. Sorry, <laughs> that maybe like <laughs> now, so is Tori still pregnant now? Yes, number five is on the way. God, you're yeah. like a rabbit, so you do have I all know, these animals. I, I, you are, you're a rabbit. I am. I, I've taken tips from the rabbits and I've applied them to my life. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, <laughs> we want to get the guy's perspective. This is my one of my favorite parts of the show. So, topic one. Topic one. We were talking about it before. Can your partner have a free pass? No. No. <laughs> no. You have nobody on your list. No. I have nobody on my list. Um, you know, I love my wife so much and think she is the hottest thing. So why would I want anything else? Uh, you've never talked about the list ever in your whole relationship about just even even if you fit. You don't believe me? I didn't say anything. Are you married? I'm, I'm close married? to it. I'm you're, close. You're getting, getting engaged. This is a great way to start by this talking is... about the free pass. Yeah, that's right. right. Honey, I want to marry you, right. but I'd also like to have sex with Kendra. <laughs> so, yeah. tell me. Yes. If she gives me a free pass for whoever I want, I am old enough in the game to know that is a setup question. I'm a little, I'm a little hurt that you didn't say me. You know, but if, I'll get over it. You, know, you have never asked her who her. That's just crazy. You got how many people have discussed this with their, with their significant other? Now look. My girl is a big fan. I okay. know she'll be watching. So why start my engagement off <laughs> on the wrong with foot. a black eye? You know I what know. I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Domestic violence is real, Bethany. It's real. <laughs> All right. But, and, and here's another thing. I mean, if I ask her, you know, because she'll bait me to maybe ask her who would she, you know, be, who would be the free, pa free pass guy, you know, and she'll give me an answer. But if she asks me and I have a real person, Right. It's, it's a problem. Right. And especially if it's a really right. You're quick gonna be like Mel too. Carter from what was right. that show back in the day? What was that show? Give me uh, a, give, give give me me a break. break. You're gonna be like Mel Carter from Give Me a Break. You want no. it to not be someone hot. Right, right. I you want no Mel offense, Nell. I mean, she yeah. did a big, big jugs, and I'm sorry, Nell. Like now I'm abusing Nell Carter on my show. Like really? <laughs> What's wrong with you? I don't know. I don't even know. Is she alive? I don't know. Why did they give me a show? <laughs> yes, she's alive. What, Sonia? No. Oh my god, yeah. I'm starting all over! I'm making fun of a I'm dead I'm making woman. fun of a dead person. All right. And you talked about her breasts. Oh my god! I don't want to be here anymore. And she I don't worked with this. nuns and orphans. Oh she my was god. a wonderful I'm woman. I'm sorry, she's so beautiful. And she's on your list, you sicko. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> topic two. <laughs> Here's the second topic. Mm -hmm. How would you feel about your fiance being mm. the breadwoman? Bread, sorry. How would you feel about your fiance being the breadwinner? That's perfectly fine. That's, like, that's yeah. Would you be? Would you? I be... need a break, man. I work hard. <laughs> Are you? The, who's the breadwinner in your relationship? Uh, we both are. She makes a pretty good, uh, nice check, and I, I do all right. I'm on the Disney Channel, so you know, it's, that's all right. You know what I mean? But now, what if you weren't? What if you weren't making any money at all, and she was doing all the work? Like, would she? How would that? How would that dynamic go? That would be great. That would be heaven. I could watch my soaps, then I can go to ESPN. Watch Bethany? I can... Yes, I could watch Bethany. All you wouldn't of it. feel, but you wouldn't feel any kind of either guilt or inferiority or complex or anything like that? You know what? I would pray about it. And if I was still unemployed after I prayed, that's Jesus telling me I need to take a break, man. I don't, I don't need to. All right, I, know, like I don't it. need to feel any kind of And way what about, about you? It. You're an actor and you're a working actor. I am a working actor, but you know, I have no bones about saying that uh, you know, T makes more than I do. You know, um, how much we, money we both... does T have? <laughs> That's the thing. Everybody thinks because she has all these businesses that we're loaded, and we're not. Well, Honestly, business we're not. not. We're not. No. I, I mean, gave you my phone number. Oh man. Well, you have a lot of expenses, <laughs> and you have legal expenses, and all kinds of stuff like and, that. I mean, five, it... five kids. So I mean, but as far as her being the breadwinner or making more than me, I have no problem with that. Um, because, you know, it's, I'm fortunate. I get to spend this time with my kids and watch them grow, which a lot of guys don't because she they're feel, nine to fivers. Does she feel a guilt that she's working more than you do? Because she's a mom. We all, mothers have such guilt. Does she feel guilty that, you know, you get to spend more time with the kids? Um, yeah, she does. She does feel guilty, but, you know, when 
when she does spend time with them, it's quality. So it, mm -hmm. it's not about quantity. It's just like really good quality time with the kids. So. And, and what about the whole gender roles thing? She does, has no issue with the fact that she makes more money than you, or that no. you that you work less than her, perhaps. No, or? no. It's, you know, I think it, I think in the whole gender world, I think it's changing. I think there's a lot more stay-at-home dads uh, nowadays. Right. What do you? Yeah, I feel like it's just such a double standard. You know, sometimes when the guy makes a lot of money and she makes no money, he's not supposed to make her feel bad that she makes no money because mm -hmm. she's You're right. she's quality. She's She's doing other things You're that right. brings things to the table. You're right. But You're right. if she makes more money, it's a problem. I know. It, it ha listen, it's an issue. It, ha it, it happens in my house. It's a little bit of an issue in my house sometimes. I Even have to say, we're only teacher, human. She's like, yeah, but can't you teach summer school? It's like, wait a minute. Well, because women, <laughs> because women are used. To, women have had it ingrained in them since they were young mm -hmm. that the man takes care. The man opens the door. The woman has the baby. The, the man pays the bills. You know, man is caveman, and man's hunter, woman's gatherer. That's just what people, women feel, and you have to kind of untrain yourself. Right. All right, we're gonna. Bethany, we have someone in the audience. Oh, okay. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. Thank nice you. To meet. What's your name? Kelly. Hi, Kelly. Hi. I feel like if I, um, if my husband's financially able to, I would love to stay home and raise my two kids. I just. I'm all for working women, but I work full time, and I have such guilt about not raising them. And another plus to staying home is that you have a better sex life. Honestly, you're so tired at night. When who's staying home? Do you have a better sex life? No, if, if the woman's okay, right now I'm on maternity. Oh, the woman stays home. You, so you stay home. If yeah, the woman yes, stays yes. home, so, you may have a much better sex life. Yes, well, not him. He's got no, his no, woman. No, is I'm not home. Cool. Home. I'm I'm home. 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 No, no, no. He don't need I to have like, no more sex ever no. again. He's all right. He's I like the man as the breadwinner because if I stay home and I'm doing my thing, I'm not as tired at night when I come home from work. I'm like ready to go, like the daytime quickie thing. You're right. Maybe that's why I'm I don't have you. as much sex as I would like because to. Because you're probably exhausted by the time you get if home. If I was like, your husband, I'd be looking for a second job. <laughs> <laughs> it, it works wonders. It works wonders. And I want to say, I loved you in Forrest Gump. I <laughs> thought you were so good in that movie. Seriously? I, I hate the break, but we have to take a break. When we come back, we're going to talk about what locations are off limits for having sex.